apologies for this. So today, I am going to film my whole day. A typical day for me, working, what I eat, um, and how I feel at almost 31 weeks pregnant. So this morning I had a 7.30 client, so I was up at 6, but she cancelled, so I went to sleep. So now it is 8 o'clock, I've got one at 9, I'm going to eat some breakfast, I'm just going to start my day now. Um, I feel a little bit like I've been hit by a bus last night, I don't know why, maybe I'm getting coming down with something, but I'm going to film it anyway, I'm going to try and be as honest as possible, I'm not going to eat anything different how I normally would, so I'm just going to make the same choices I would if I wasn't filming. So pretty much for the whole of my pregnancy, I have had bran flakes in the morning due to the fact that it's got folic acid, vitamin B12, B6, um, vitamin D, I think it's really good for your digestion, which I have needed, I'm not going to go into detail, but this is a really weak filter coffee, um, and bran flakes, that's what I have in the morning. <laughs> drive there now, have my coffee and my bran flakes and I'm good to go. It's half past ten. Um, we did a little bit extra work because um, she needed some more ab work done because she's post-pregnancy. Anyway, um, I just thought I would say that today I don't think I can fit in a workout um, just because my clients are kind of spread out through the day um, but usually I try and get in um, a workout I might try and just join in with the clients um, here and there so I'm kind of active all day which personally I find makes a massive difference makes me much more comfortable um, rather than just staying still I it, I yeah if I stay still she's kicking loads and my belly feels more uncomfortable and stuff so I just like to keep moving um it's also it's also worth saying that I should have done one of these day in the life videos before I was pregnant I think just to kind of as a comparison because I usually have uh so much energy I wouldn't say I'm tired or I have little energy now but compared to usually I am like running around like crazy I'm working out all day I'm super energetic just a little bit more chilled now I guess it might be something to do with the fact that it's not summer I don't know but yeah my body's a bit heavier I take things a bit slower um I tend to have to eat more regularly and stuff so um yeah, I'm tough as 10. I would love to have now some biscuits or something and a cup of tea, but I've got another client, so I'm gonna go to her house and drink tons of water because I, because I forgot my water, because I'm an idiot. Just finishing up with my second client. Second client done. It is 10 past 12 and I'm gonna go home for some lunch because my energy dips a little bit now. Um, I ate last at my bran flakes at 10 past eight this morning. So I'm gonna go home, have a bunch of water and some probably high fat foods and I will show you what I eat. Oh my God, our Jules day two has arrived. We're we gonna put it up. 
Hey, then take it down. I'm going to show you what it looks like up this side. Okay, so I have gone for some juice in my water and I've got tuna on like a, mm, what is that, squash, like rusty type thing, basically overcooked butternut squash, some greens, some feta and some avocado. So yeah, protein, fats, carbs, and I will probably have some kind of chocolate after, but I'll let you know. <laughs> I'm at my next client, but I thought I'd be completely honest. I ate a whole bag of Kit Kat minis and my head is banging. I've had a headache all day. I don't know if I'm coming down with something, but um, I had an hour's rest and some lunch and some Kit Kats and now I'm back on it. Sorry, it's been a bit boring, but I haven't really had time to work out today. Just this has just been a day in the life. I've just got to my last session of the day. Um, the day has been pretty typical for me in terms of food and what I'm doing. I though I haven't trained, which I've been a bit gutted about. I've got DOMS from yesterday, so maybe a rest is good. So might be a bit boring for you that I've just kind of taken you to I've not been able to show you all of the workouts I've been doing with people but just kind of showing you where I am and what I'm doing anyway my boyfriend just messaged me asked me if I want to go for pizza tonight I mean obviously I want to go to pizza tonight go for have pizza tonight but I have this dilemma that I don't need pizza and I had a full bag of Kit Kat bites today. Do I go for pizza? Will it make me feel like crap? Will I have bloated, uncomfortable belly after? But it's Friday night and I've... Oh, I don't know. I don't know what to do. If I leave it until I'm starving... Because right now it's like half six. I finish at half seven. If I'm starving, I'll go for pizza. So I need to make a decision now. Anyway, I'm going to do this last session with my client who is training for the marathon. So we're going to work on some glute um, strength and core. I might join in with the glute things and... Um, yeah, I'll show you what decision I make later with food. It might be pizza. I don't know. I'm blaming the baby. Yeah, I'm not really sure. I'm not sure you work out. I'm finished for the day. It is about quarter to eight. I have finished all my clients. I haven't had a chance to train myself today. So I usually would have got to the gym or something in the afternoon and then had a snack, but I haven't eaten since lunchtime at one o'clock. So I'm hungry and I'm probably gonna eat something before I have dinner, whatever dinner's gonna be. Maybe a banana, maybe some Nutella on it. Let's see. Done for the evening. Look at the state of me. <laughs> I'm gonna have a shower in a minute. So I came home and Dom has been for a run so he's quite keen on pizza and we basically rock paper scissors pizza or eating at home and we've gone for pizza. 
outside of this little guy. She's having pizza. It's Friday night. I thought I'd be honest with you guys. That's what's happening. Frank and Manka. Here we go. Again. <laughs> start with something shit, I want to end it shit. The pizza was amazing, but I just said pizza. <laughs> I'm home with my choice. I mean, come on. Salted caramel. I couldn't say no. So, this is my sign off. It's been a long day, probably not very interesting for people who on a PT, <laughs> um, but that's kind of what I eat in a day. I'll probably eat all of this. It's not been a very good day for me for food. I had pizza, I had Kit Kats, but that's what I ate today. Tomorrow I'm probably gonna be a lot healthier and have a good healthy breakfast. I'm gonna train tomorrow for sure, and yeah. But sometimes this happens, I'm 30 weeks pregnant and I've been basically eating what I want and I've been hating myself for it up until recently I'm just kind of letting it happen but you got a few weeks left and then I'm gonna be super healthy when she comes that's the aim so until then I'm gonna to listen to my body and say yes to things that I you wouldn't usually say yes to but good night and see you at week 20 no 30